Hello folks, friends, how's it going? Well today <coughs> I'll come down to the, oh welcome to my channel, Wild Britain. Today we're just having a winter walk down by the River Thames between Weybridge and Walton. Um, there was a thick mist earlier this morning but unfortunately I, I missed that, doesn't matter. Just come out to get some fresh air, hope you're all doing well. And we're just going to take a stroll see what we can see but the river thames this is the back part of the river thames so let's have a wander a chat and enjoy a winter's day i'm using the gopro 10 for the first time today and i've got a new gimbal for it because it didn't fit to uh, fit my old one which was the steady two um, which adapts to the up to the GoPro 7 but not Gro, GoPro 10 so I brought this new one but I still keep the other one there's a nice quiet walk by the river today just to come out and enjoy a bit of fresh air get this straightened up so this is the back part of the River Thames, it's a place I used to fish a lot years ago, some of these swims down here. It's quite cold today, um, temperatures around 4 degrees Fahrenheit, which is I think about 31 Celsius, something like that. So it's quite cold, it's not freezing, but we'll have a walk down this muddy track and just enjoy the outdoors. <clears throat> Plus the fact is with this unfortunate Omicron virus that's going around at the moment I'd like to be going back to London fairly soon but I'm keeping away from London at the moment Oh, a couple of seagulls It's a muddy old track down here so I've got to make sure I don't slip But I really wanted to do this I'm just a little bit disappointed that the mist has disappeared. I, I really wanted to uh, show you the river with a misty look to it, but I'll do that later. We'll definitely come back again, or another part of the river. But I just thought I'd show you this part of the River Thames, um, which I don't think you've seen before. Old Father Thames is what we call it. I can't remember why it's called Old Father Thames. Don't hear that so much these days, but there you go. So all the leaves have fallen virtually now from the trees. Some of the trees have still got leaves on. I'm not sure the names of them, but some still got leaves on. But it really is quite a uh, quite a winter's day today nobody down here though. I wanted to get away from everybody really just to just you and I have a little walk out I can hear some dog walkers enjoying some of the fresh air the other thing I have to be careful on this path are the uh, the tree roots nearly tripped over them quite a few times Go and have a look at the yacht club over the other side. Well, that's the White House I told you about. I think we'll have a walk towards Weybridge. I showed you Chinese Bridge. They can hear the parakeets, <laughs> they're never far away. There's a paddleboard coming down the river now.
That's one way of keeping warm, isn't it? Good luck to him. So this is where <coughs> this is where the desperate cut. This was known as the desperate cut comes in, part of the River Thames. And then it opens out towards this small marina just ahead. You can see the Chinese bridge. We'll go and have a walk down towards there. And there's a big weir there. And that's when we come into Weybridge. Oh, look at this black and white boat. It's lovely. What a big one too. Oh dear, dog and geese, they don't get on too well do they? <laughs> So this is what they call the Chinese Bridge. If I remember rightly, that house used to belong to somebody to do with insurance in the City of London. But I don't know who owns it now, if anybody does. somebody there, a lovely old house though, really like the architect on that, that room on the roof, the dome tiles on the left up the top, very nice. Coming towards Weybridge now. <clears throat> There's a fabulous tree over the other side, see? Love the shape of that. Still got quite a few of the leaves on it as well. And the house on the right there, look at that house on the right, all those windows and different shapes on the roof. Got the pampas grass outside as well, which is nice. Made me jump. <laughs> Broke me up then. What's going on? So this is the weir at Weybridge. Got a few canoes going in and out of there. I might put the other camera on and stick the zoom lens on, see if we can get some of the action. 
because some years ago we had a year of exceptional rain and the river came right over that far bank where all the grass is came right over the top of there everywhere around here was completely flooded Well, that was quite a nice winter's walk along the river, wasn't it? If you're new to my channel, welcome to Wild Britain. Next year, we're going to be doing a lot more nature reserve uh, videos and some photography and travelling around the country. But at the moment, we're just enjoying a bit of fresh air, coming out down to the river and just taking it nice and easy. But the channel's all about England and the changing seasons and just enjoying the great outdoors. So if you're new, welcome. And if you've got any questions, always grateful and I'll always get back to you with some kind of an answer. But right now, it's coffee time and home. So I'll see you again. Bye bye.